Aquarius Kenshin just hit 10 million. Everyone is saying their goodbyes. YouTubers and friends are congratulating, but me. Why do you ask? He's not leaving. You guys think that Corey's Genshin is immediately retiring after he hit 10 million. And for that, I say this is just the beginning. Hi, my name is Gemsdale. In this video, I prove why Corey's Genshin isn't retiring. Ever since he stopped uploading in March, there was a whole goose chase on the internet trying to find out where Corey's Genshin is or like what he was doing or what happened to him. So I made a video called Where is Corey's Kitchen? And I found out that he was with Dashi at a hotel and I just kept going through reasons why he's just fine and he's still like, okay. And a few weeks later, someone commented on that video saying that Corey was dead and I obviously did not believe it. And a few days after that, like more people started to comment it and it started, it, it started to concern me a lot more. I knew he wasn't dead, but like I still was wondering why people thought that he was dead. So I just started doing some research. Someone commented that they found it on a TikTok. So, and someone told me that it shows up on Google and I did some research. So I made a video called Aquarius Kenshin Found Dead and I just explained that the rumors were fake and some TikTokers just decided to do an April Fool's prank and someone decided to like make a prank website saying that Aquarius Kenshin was dead and apparently Google for some reason put that on there and people believed it. I don't know why dude, like it's, it's stupid. I don't know why they believed it, but yeah, um, I made that video to just expose the fake rumors and the community did not react to that video very well, but um, most people really enjoyed the video, but that video got completely disliked bombed and I got like a lot of hate for the clickbait and a lot of death threats, which is not a good sign in the samurai. But yeah, it was a bit much and I, after that, I took a break from YouTube because I had to graduate and while I was on break, like a bunch of commentary YouTubers were making videos saying like Corey's Genshin is canceled, Corey's Genshin is disgusting, or Corey's Genshin updates that I wasn't doing and apparently Corey's Genshin was in California with his family. And I found out through um, his brother who uploaded a vlog on YouTube called Cali Vibes. And he basically went to California with his family. And it was really entertaining, but yeah, you guys should go check that out. But while I was gone, he continued to grow at like a really fast rate. And I literally predicted that he would hit 10 mil two months from now. And not now, but like from the time I made that video and it's been more than two months but yeah he's hit it now and like it's surprising how fast that went dude it was like it was like a blink of an eye dude that was so fast but while I was gone on Wednesday June 23rd 2021 he hit 10 million subscribers which was last night for me and I know what you're thinking he's at 10 million he's retiring Wait, I'm not done. He's not leaving forever, guys. He's coming back, I promise. And if you keep up with Corey Kenshin's brother or mom on Instagram, you can usually see Corey Kenshin just hanging out with his family and having a good time. And, um, one, Corey Kenshin's mom, Mama Kenshin, as we call her, and she was live on Instagram at her shop and she was wearing Corey's Kenshin's new merch that he hasn't released yet and you this isn't even on the shop guys this merch I don't even have a picture but um this merch hasn't been released yet and it's super new and the entire store was stocked up with new Corey's Kenshin merch that's for one second um the second reason why I don't think Corey's Kenshin is retiring is because one, do you 
guys really think he would take a break because he wanted to retire? No, he does not want to retire. That's the reason why he took a break. He wants to take a break from social media because he's overwhelmed by the the fast amount of growth he's having right now and does not want to quit. He does not want to leave his fans right now. So that's the reason why he took a break because he's overwhelmed and doesn't want to quit that fast. But yeah, then third, just hold up two, third, um, he said he's announcing his retirement. He didn't say he's retiring at 10 mil. Guys, seriously, he's announcing his retirement. So he could be saying at like a specific date and a specific goal. He didn't say he's retiring at 10 mil. Oh my gosh, it was so hard to get that through people's heads, dude. And I can understand that Corey didn't want to retire because he's growing so fast right now. And I can understand that because um, he didn't want us to think about it, which is funny because everybody could not stop thinking about it. Like it was the entire comment section on his videos. Like you, you can't avoid it, Corey. Like people will still talk about it either way because it was super close and you're growing so fast. And um, without him uploading, he had all of his content creators trying to turn into Sherlock Holmes to try to find out the mystery of Corey's Kenshin. And I decided to do like, First off, Corey's Kenshin found dead, then where is Corey's Kenshin, and now Corey's Kenshin goodbyes. That's that's this video by the way. Um But yeah, Corey's Kenshin isn't retiring. He's gonna come back ready, full of energy, with another banger video for us. But for now, keep watching his videos. Keep watching my videos, please. And the Samurai Strong. Well, that's the end of the year, guys. Um, that's all the information I had, and I really just want to give you guys some information and some updates because I'm loyal to the samurai, and I really love you guys so much. You guys have no idea, like, so many of these things went viral, but um, seriously, guys, I, I love you guys a lot, and that's the end of you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. Here's a shout out, here's a description. Subscribe, and I'll see you depression.